Toad, come here. I thought I made myself very clear. I see how it is. Passed off to an underling, eh? Why am I not surprised? Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall, it is. Now, I'm sure you've got your own agenda, Sheriff. But I've taken a real bullet. Before we get into any of that, what do you know about the crooked man? Don't try to change a subject on me. I need a little bit of that walking around money, you know? My car, total, the gaping mall in my wall. Any of us sound familiar? I'm not looking for a handout. Just what's right. I need it, Big B. Look, Crane left us in the lurch here. Just can't be handing out cash unless it's something, you know, urgent. I wish I could help. But... Me and my boy getting shipped off to the farm is pretty bloody urgent to me. And I even brought in this damn magic coat. I could have sold it, but I know you wanted it. This isn't exactly a new problem with you, Toad. You know that if you're out of glamour, I gotta send you to the farm. Well, how about your friend the pig? Hmm? Is he going to the farm too? Yeah. You thought we didn't know about him, huh? A worst kept secret in fable times. For a friend, the rules will bend. That's a slippery slope, that is. Colin isn't your concern. You should worry about your own fucking situation, Toad. Rotten bastard. Oh, no, no, it came out wrong. If you give me one more chance and hear me out, I'll see a way for me and me boy to stay. I'm not gonna ask for any more than I need. I just want to stay. So what do you say? You just give me enough to cover me glamours and we'll call the rest a wash. Please, Sheriff. Don't take TJ from the only home he knows. This old glamour rule is oppressive. I've done nothing wrong but look different. Look, I'll try to get you that money and get you another chance, but you have to understand, it's not entirely up to me. Oh, thank you, Sheriff. I knew I could count on you to make me whole again. We get you sorted and I'll be glamoured to the nines, I will. Vale, ya está la ranita feliz. Que no tengo dinero, así que ya veremos. Uy, ya está visto como que tú un tanto con él. Now's your chance. I've just made my donation funding this office. So direct your questions to Miss White. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not? For now. Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, but glamours are the law for a very good reason. You know that as well as anyone. Don't worry. I did the right thing. Are you sure? Because he left looking pretty happy. <sighs> Fine. We'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking how it got like this, but I just keep wondering why it happened to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the Crooked Man killed them with his own hand or if it was one of his goons. If there's one thing I've figured out, it's that the Crooked Man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop, the magic he peddles, chains, ribbons. Maybe Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told. Or maybe they just tried to leave. Sheriff, Miss White! I believe the mirror is repaired. Vale, listo el espejito. I have to say I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry, I just... I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. He's probably still waking up a little. Yeah, I want to see where he's ended up to. Ah, que está muerto. You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the crooked man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. ¿Cómo lo sabe? ¿Pero cómo lo sabe? What just ¿Qué puta? Happened? We pointed you in the wrong direction and looked at Bloody Mary's reflection. Oh, her. 
That explains the sting. I'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings. So, let's not do that again, okay? Looks like we'll have to track him down later. You're right. We need to focus on the immediate threat, and that's the Crooked Man. Espejito, Bigby, espejito. we don't have a lot of time. <sighs> mirror, mirror. No time to pout. So, where does Crooked Man hang out? I don't recognize the door, but that's the Crooked Man symbol on it. Hold off. What? The door. It moves. Yeah, Jersey mentioned that. Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. When you get the Crooked Man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Bueno, ya veremos. We can't just dispense street justice. I know that emotions can run high, and you have your reasons to handle this a certain way. I'll catch him and bring him back here, alive. Then we can clean him and cook him together. Good. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. Of course I'm ready. I got no other choice. Vale. Hasta luego, señorita. Vamos a Central Park. Y a ver si por fin podemos encontrar la puerta y ver quién es el hombre torcido. El puente gótico Central Park, calle 94. Eh, claro, tiene que ir a toda hostia para entrar en la puerta. Ahí está. Hostias. ¿Dónde cojones estamos? Tim, what the hell are you doing? Esta la ranita, ¿no? Good evening, sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. I think I'd have outgrown that centuries ago. I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. I know you aren't here on a social call, so thanks for not giving me a hard time. What is this place? Or where is it? I know I'm not in Central Park anymore. I'm not sure. I've only ever come in through one of the portals. I don't think you can get in from the actual street. But you can't blame him for wanting to make it hard to find. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Look, this is the one thing I have to do. Please don't make this hard on me. Fine, lead on. Huh? O sea, es que están todos confabulados, ¿no? Con el cabrón este. Thanks for understanding. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard, or an escort for that matter. I was a little surprised myself when they asked me to do it. I thought it was a joke, actually. I get it. You have a job to do. But you gotta ask yourself if you want to be involved with this guy. Whatever you may think of him, he doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job, and I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe? Because if you and the boss go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is going to get caught in the middle. And if you're here, it can't be good. I can find the door myself. You should just get the hell out of here. Things are going to get ugly in a minute. Leave. I told you, I have to do this. Hey, you've been warned. Stick around, and you're a part of this, just like anyone else. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. 
We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Hey, Sheriff, hold up. Hm? I gotta go in with you. Can't you just wait up, Sheriff? Hold on. Thanks. <laughs> what did I tell you, Eddie? Stop laughing at me. Oh, yeah? Mate. I Tell me who the scared. fuck is back there. It's the wolf I got I, from. I don't exactly know. I, I just mind the door. He'll come around. The boss is there. And King Kunio is. I'm sure he will prove himself quite handy to have in my pocket. Either he's smart enough to see... Es que no, no están los subtítulos eso. Quiero... ...dim enough to do as he's told. What the fuck? Holy shit! Ooh, aquí está la banda. Hombre, hostias, ¿quién es? Quiero ver al puto jefe. ¿Es este? I was wondering when you turn up. I'm so sorry, sir. I had no idea so right, he would. Tim. I shouldn't have expected the sheriff to give you respect enough to do your job, but you did fine. You can go now. Si aquí hacemos una lucha siempre suele ganar. discuss. ¿En serio me van a dejar así con la mierda? ¿Hasta el siguiente capítulo? No puede ser, Dios mío. I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how scary. The wolf is coming. And they would wait, hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. <sighs> oh well. Pues nada chicos, parece que aquí acaba. Tú y el 84 y pico por ciento decidiste que Coli se quedara. Eh, no le quita este. Hostias, claro, podríamos haberla matado si hubiéramos quitado el este. Eh, vale, la mayoría fuimos primero. ¿Cómo? Creo que de operación. Ah, vale, primero fuimos a por el, a por el carnicero. Ahí damos a Toad. Y solo el 41% de las personas queríamos, nos pusimos de, eh, vamos a hablar contigo. Madre mía, pues nada chicos, parece que vamos a dejar aquí el capítulo. Y nos vemos en el próximo capítulo de The World Among Us. Aunque seguramente antes habrán sacado, sacarán el quinto episodio de Walking Dead, porque suelen hacer eso. Van a casi un mes por episodio, primero de Walking Dead y luego ya de World Among Us. Así que nada chicos, hasta el último capítulo de esta temporada. Hasta la próxima. Chicos. Goes, the play is harder, transpose, we're gonna